Okay guys, in this video we're gonna go over how to improve your thoracic mobility. So our thoracic is gonna be anything rib cage and up, right? So pressure point or area that gets tight, it's gonna be our upper inner back, might be our shoulders, might just be our chest in general. You know, if, you, if you feel like you can't take a full breath of air, it could be because you just have uh, everything that's super tight, right? So we're gonna come up and across, nice and, nice and easy, right? But we're also gonna twist with it. So we're twisting away from that same arm from there, we're gonna come through like so. I'm trying to elbow across my body to like the outside of my hip, right? Boom, boom. I'm actually moving my legs too. That way I get a lot of momentum and I can bring all my upper body into twisting my upper back, right? Our upper thoracic is really good at rotation and then from here down is really good at flexion. So the other one we can do is kind of not a toe touch per se. I have a slight bend in my knees i'm coming down here i'm going to throw my hips forward and then coming back so all this coming back i'm stretching all the tendons and ligaments in my chest all the way up to like my collarbone right so we're coming back <sighs> exhale and back down back up knock that out for 30 60 seconds all right next one that we can do is just swimming forward so kind of start with one hand in the middle swim to it let that one come down and come forward so swims this is gonna be mostly shoulders but in doing so I'm opening up my chest and my thoracic cavity like so right may not opening up the thoracic cavity but allowing it to expand further as I'm doing this anytime that you open or you bring your arms away from the body take a big breath of air because that's gonna push your lungs full of air right and it's also gonna push from the inside out so Instead of having you know, a, a collapsing force, like if you're going really deep underwater, we have an internal that's pushing out, right? Take a big, big swinging motion as if you're trying to do like a reverse uh, discus, right? So coming out, like so. So start our full breath. So looks funny, but again, we're trying to open up the rib cage. We're trying to decompress the back. The next simple one is going to be more of a dynamic stretch. We're just coming through and slapping herself on the back, right? On the back of the shoulder. So stretching my chest on the way out. I'm stretching my back on the way in, right? So these are going to be the main stretches that really help to kind of open up that thoracic cavity, that thoracic uh, spine as well. And we're doing a dynamic fashion, so these are going to be more like before doing exercise rather than uh, post. If you're doing it post, you want to hold it. You want to hold these stretches, right? But this is going to be more dynamic, so more of a warm-up based uh, thoracic mobility. So I hope this helps. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe below. We also have an introduction course that you can click on in the description below. It goes over motivation, workouts, foundation, uh, building a good nutrition, and putting it all together for a plan of action that helps you to get the ball rolling in your fitness and health or to improve upon it. And from there, you can even check out the whole website all again in the link below. So I'll catch you in the next video. Hope this helps. Take care.